Okay, your friends, are you ready to travel? Get your suitcase. We're gonna leave South Africa and we are going to fly from South Africa. We're gonna fly across the Indian Ocean to Japan. So Japan is this country. It's kind of east of China, south from Russia, Japan. And to give you an idea, across the Pacific Ocean, and there's America. We have Japan and America. So let's learn a little bit about Japan. If you ever want to draw a picture of Japan's flag, I think you can. So Japan's flag is white with a red circle right in the middle. So there's a Japan Japanese flag. Let's read a little bit about Japan and see what celebration we're gonna learn about. So in Japan, there is a huge Japanese kite festival. Ooh, this sounds like fun. Have you ever flown a kite? They're a lot of fun. So in Japan, there's a huge Japanese kite festival. The kite festival happens in late spring during a time period known as Golden Week. Hundreds of kites are flown and battle in the sky. The kites are decorated with names of baby boys from each town, along with symbols or designs to represent each town. Teams of many people fly the huge kites. In some of the videos, there's a lot of big kites we'll see. And teams of many people fly the huge kites. The aim is to try and cut the opponent's kite strings using friction. So when you have your kite and your string, if you rub two strings together, it causes friction and eventually the string will break. So that's what they try to do. In the evening, there is a parade of floats and music. So today we're gonna to learn a little bit more about Japan and the kite festival, the Japanese kite festival. And in some of the videos, you'll see them. Lots of people trying to use friction on the strings to see if you can get the other people's kites down. It's kind of fun. Anyways, so that's what we're gonna learn about in Japan. And so do the Bitmoji, choose two videos, comment in Google Classroom and tell me which ones you chose. And then we're gonna make a craft. And your craft today is you are gonna make a fish kite, a Japanese kish fish kite. So that's another video on Bitmoji Classroom if you wanna watch a long video on how to make one. But you're gonna see many kites in the sky. And afterwards, you see many people flying the kites and you can hear music and see parades. So, forgot to read you that part of the story. So friends, have fun in learning a little bit more about Japan and I will see you in our next video. Adios.